big old loaf of bread from the store. It's nice and early. Let's do this thing. So I was able to do a bunch of my, my work today. You've learned many impressive things since you joined that squad. Auditions. So I had to move my microphone around. So if I sound a little different, apologies. I might make myself a little bit hotter here. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba, ba. Um, but I had to move my microphone set up and everything around. So, uh, oh, and I've got my, my green tank top on. So you guys can see more of the game. That's kind of cool, actually. Um, so I'm gonna keep it. Um, but yeah, it's been already a little bit of a, a long day, my friends, but you know what? I'm never gonna beat this game if I don't not play it. So we gotta keep pushing. Um, plug in my phone. I am gonna make a, a delicious vegan spaghetti tonight with some beyond meat so uh, I'll probably play for like a couple hours maybe two or three um, and if I'm able to get all my my chores done I might sneak back on and play more but we'll see I'm actually gonna fix my microphone real quick <laughs> thanks Paige one second no I'm using um these kind of like green spinach noodles uh, kite one sec That's a bit better. Okay. My microphone is just sort of hanging off the uh, hanging off the edge of one of the monitors, and so it was like 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 this, so I, or like that. So I pushed it over like that. Anyway, what's up, Johnny? Okay. Uh, let's get this thing. Isn't it weird, Jake Cox? I'm like, I am. In the river, I'm just I'm just a pair of arms and a floating head. Uh, let me do this though. I'm gonna give a pause to my rainy mood. Now we can just hear the ocean, or the lake. I don't know what this is, where this is in the game. I'm assuming we'll learn at some point. So let's let's see where we left off. I can't remember a dang thing. Um, but let's see here. All right. Let's continue with the Seraphites. What's up, Timmy? How's it going? Oh, hey, Ashley Blessing. Welcome, welcome. What's up, Fevin? Hey, I remember you, Fevin, from uh, the stream last night at Kyle's. Thanks for y'all that went uh, to watch that. That was really fun. I don't really get to talk to Lucy very much. Um, You've uh, learned many impressive so that was things good. since you joined that squad. Oh, thanks for the host, Jay and BM Cardoso. Appreciate it. Um, again, apologies about starting so early today. But um, I wanted to knock, I wanted to get some ways into the game a bit because I feel like I'm lagging on this one. And uh, I need to be sure that I'm ready for our Origami King, which I have set up. And I've never played Paper Mario, so this one will be fun. Um, yeah, just trying to make room for games and make sure I'm setting aside time. I was literally thinking about the story from The Last of Us Part Two while I was on my, my road trip. I was trying to brainstorm how I would have written um, parts of the script. So I'm, I'm really excited to see what happens. But um, yeah. 
Yeah, last night was fun. That was weird. It was last night. Guys, I'm losing my concept of time. <laughs> like, that was last night. Okay, so just to catch you guys up on what I've been up to in this game, um, I've been taking it pretty slow. Um, hang on, I gotta turn off my alert. Turn off my alerts because this is annoying. One second. Or actually, I should just turn off my online. One second. Hang on. Let's give this thing a shot. So where we left off in the game, I think we just got through uh, being in the hospital or headed to the hospital rather. So, oh yes, yeah, so there's the conference center. We made a joke about the, uh, yeah, we're headed to the hospital. But we made a joke about there being like no conventions right now and it's super sad, so anyway. Yeah, this is the actual Seattle Convention Center. Sakura-Con, Emerald City Comic-Con, or Emerald City Comic-Con, yeah. That's so cool, CC. Yeah, I heard I heard about that. People were, were mentioning that. Um, so let's, let's break in and, and have our own convention. <laughs> Wait, I don't know. I gotta, rem I gotta remember my weapons. Okay, I think I want that. And that is loud, all right. What's up, lunchtime crew? I love this game, uh, Lunchtime. I, I should say I love, I'm a fan of the series, big fan of the series. So <clears throat> it's no surprise to me that I'm enjoying it. But yeah, so this is where, this is where we'd be having conventions. Ah, 2013. I um, was asking my agent about trying to get into Emerald City Comic Con because uh, my buddy Josh Greeley had went and I noticed he was one of the few My Hero voice actors going, and I said, hey, I love Josh. Um, I'm in My Hero. Let me, can I tag along? Or because And also my brother lives in um, Seattle. So I thought it would be a cool kind of twofer. But alas, it didn't happen. And then on top of that, coronavirus. So. <laughs> All right, um, let's see what's going on. It looks like down might be bad I guess we'll keep going up then can we not why would you have me go up here huh what comics movies toys cosplay and more and more pistol fire is the and more All right let's see um I gotta remember my button since it's been a minute all right looks like we can climb down the scaffolding that way Although I'm really curious why you would let me go up there, you know. Perhaps there's something this way. You know what I mean, like up that way. Nope. Oop. Guess not. Oh man, beige. This is so cool. Uh, it was really awesome to be able to hang out um, from Com New York Comic Con with uh, with Justin. Since we're both m trained in musical theater a bit, we were musing at how we were there in New York, you know, on um, on the Broadway. And I asked him, Justin, did you ever think that we would be here in this capacity? That we'd be at like Madison Square Garden doing this? And he just shook his head. He's like, absolutely not. <laughs> Never thought that it would be like this. And so it was, it was a really humbling, fun experience. Um, yeah. Me to Synthex Hybrid. What is that sound? All right, I guess we're just gonna go for this jump. Like, if that didn't wake up everyone. All right. Okay, I don't 
here anything. Let's clear this. Let's clear this area first before we start getting all crazy. So you're the newbie in training, rookie noobs. Thanks for the follow, Sniper Fox. And again, thanks to y'all that were able to make it out um, for Kyle's stream last night. It was super fun. What's up, Freedom Gamer? Going all right? Yes, I've heard of Beyond Two Souls. I played it, I pre-ordered it, and I played the heck out of it. I did enjoy it quite a bit, actually. And I remember my uh, the advice that Raito gave me, um, one of my pals that plays this game, or at least is aware of the game. Oh, come on. Those are crates that definitely look like they could be destroyed. Um, Raito had mentioned in this game, if you don't see your HUD, then there's no enemies around. Because for the most part, I play this game just constantly listening, creeping around like a rogue. Um, and there's no need at the moment, so. Although this does feel like, since it's boarded up, this is a place where infected will come through. So, I saw that side. Looks like this side had some glass I could get in through if this is locked. So it might be locked, but maybe it's not. All right. That's cool, because we can get in this way, I think. What's up, Crystal? Hey, Demonic. Sorry, Demonic, I know you are in there earlier. I'm, I keep, there's like, I, I have kind of a, a bit of a, a ADD tendencies. And so when something does make its way into my mind and it sticks there, I keep thinking, all right, Demonic's birthday's on Monday. What happens on Monday? Demonic's birthday's on Monday. <laughs> so apologies if I somehow forget because that's, that's how my brain works. <laughs> Class. All right, let's break it. Let me in, let me in. Nice. Cool. We got in here stuff, things, one part. Oh, now that's more like it. Some shoddy ammo. Ooh, that's nice. Arch enemy. Well, he looks like a bad guy. Marcus Fordham, Brain 60, Bronze 60, affiliation none, a former army sharpshooter and seasoned bow hunter. He's Hawkeye, but bad. Um, this vigilante's path was forged when his family was caught in the crossfire between the New Dogs and the Society of Champions. Destroyed by grief, he turned to the most dangerous game. Not human, but superhuman donning high-tech camouflage and claiming the moniker Arch Enemy. He's menaced both sides of the war with his hunter's instinct, compound bow, and arsenal of high-tech traps. All right. Um, hey, Mina. Man, you like glass that much, Beige? <laughs> I mean, I guess I'll keep breaking it. I'm sure that there's a... Uh... Oh my god, wait, look at all this stuff! Look at all this stuff! Whoa, we gotta make something, right? Gotta make some arrows. I guess we can upgrade this. I'll give it more hits. Oh, that was kind of dumb. I think that was foolish of me. That's okay. You win some, you lose some. Um, all right, I think we did it. Yeah, we got all the stuff. Don't yuck my yum. <laughs> I would never yuck your yum. Everyone's got their thing. For instance, I like killing clickers with a bottle and a hammer. That's my thing. You like glass. The broken kind, specifically. Um, all right, I think I, I think I did what I gotta do. All up in dare. Okay. <clears throat> use my increased hair I just want to double check what we got going on for our, our meds because we've maxed out the stealth tree which is helpful so our stealth kills are faster which is my favorite um, we're really close to getting endure which just lets you not die when you're about to die that's I right. I feel like if I was gonna die like get one shot and that's how it is although it'd be really cool if they had some special animation for it that'd totally be worth because I'd love to see that Crafting, helpful. I don't use a lot of bombs. I kind of prefer trying to get better at hit scan, even though I'm not the best. Um, this is the this is the area right here. Um, 
stability, aim, listen mode, range, holding breath, and then crafting more arrows is where we're headed. So, yeah. Oh, I love it. Vale, vale Lala. Um, I feel like Mirio is really a great character for a lot of beginners too, because um, even if you haven't mastered him, just pressing triangle and being invincible is a nice feeling. <laughs> Key is to punch Mario's feet. Stinks in here. People pooping. Now, so you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. If it stinks, and that means thanks for the follow. Thanks for the follow to Tino's Pizza six six six. Um, that means there's probably people here, man. Do you know what I mean? Because if there's no fungus, there's no spores, and it smells like poops. Then there's probably peoples. Um, all right, let's do this. Let's do this. Oh, yeah, you a person for sure. I see that. I see you there. Actually, let's use our. You've learned many impressive things since you joined that squad. Our shoddy since uh. Definitely want to do that. Nope. Nope. There we go. So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting spooky vibes too. But look at, like, this dude. This dude got shredded, y'all. What is that? Is that your phone? Okay, that's that. I was like, what is that sound? Sorry, there was a phone playing in the background. I was like, what is that? I thought there was something spooky happening. No, it's all good. I just didn't know if it was something in the game. That was funny. All right, girlfriend was watching like an Instagram video or something and I heard the I was like, what the hell is that? Anyway, all right, um, let, and that doesn't look good either right there. I'm not hearing things, Amalia. I knew it was true. This reminds me of that stupid white uh, what is it? Uh, Swan? Not White Swan. What's the game? The horror game we're playing? Where you can hide from the janitor? This is that. Fucking wolf. Serves you right. Okay, this body looks kind of old. White Day. Thank you, Demonic. Oh, no worries, Marcus. That, um, that story gets me too every time. Um, it's weird as time goes on. I remember being so affected by it, and now I've, I've told the story enough times to where I feel like I've reconciled it. Oh, oh shit, did you see that? Did you see that shit? Fuck me. Of course my freaking... Spooky! She ran. I'm gonna shotgun you. Come back here. Why don't you come back and get shotgunned? You about to get shotgunned. Cause I got ammo back there. Where you at? I know you here somewhere. They're pretty stealthy, dude. They're pretty stealthy. One big thing in the Last of Us multiplayer game, you could, you could put points into stealth, which means that even if someone's listening, you won't be able to see them. So, you can also get ganked. Like this right here is like prime. I'm gonna turn off my light, bro. I mean, that light is just gonna give away my position. What's going on? Let's use our, let's use our abilities, hey? Okay. You in here? You gonna pop out of here, you stupid? I will shotgun you. Are you hiding in the roof? In the, in the T-bar? I've got shotgun shells to burn, my friend. Hey, big man, get back here, big man, running away. I got some shotgun shells for you. Yeah, totally, Tab. 
It's like auto save. Actually, I'm gonna save. <laughs> Damn it. It was good. That was good. I got, I got, uh, I will admit, I got proper spooked a little. Oh no, Fevin. This is totally what Seattle looked like when Corona hit. That's too soon. Hang on. Actually, maybe it's not too soon. It's actually very appropriate. Right. Um, can I please do that? Where you at, where you at bro? Is this thing gonna come down? Great. Feel like you're in there, dude. You're gonna pop out. <sighs> That's where I would be. Ah, oh, damn it. All right, well, I guess that means we gotta, gotta keep moving then. If we go into the next area, I'm not gonna be able to go back and get those shotgun shells, so. Righto, no spoilers. What do I do now? Alright. Oh man. <clears throat> Fuck that. That's a nice one there. Cover my back a little. Get outside. Well, don't worry, we're gonna kill all y'all. So they can't see my light, which is good. So I don't know if we can sneak up on them because they're also very stealth. Such stealth. I'm glad they have enemies like this though that teach you how to utilize Stealth. Give me that. I think I can go back and collect that too if I blow it. to get eyes on one. And the music gets crazy loud when you uh, aren't stealthing. I say crazy loud, and by crazy loud I just mean louder. I guess I should just go in melee now. The 
They're fine. They're healthy. They're feeling good. Oh, come on. Surely one of y'all have an arrow for me. So it seems the methodology for these dudes is like, just run around and let them, like getting the drop on them almost feels like a waste of time. Almost. Okay, they're back there. We're just gonna go. I don't know why Ellie seems so scared about these fools. They seem pretty weak. Of course I say that and then watch them get the drop on me. Get it, go get it. Get it. There you are. So far, so good. Doing good. Still got my HUD up, though, so there's still a few left. And or one or two? Oh, no, it's gone. My HUD finished up. So that means there's no more. Headshot. Headshot. I should craft some more arrows. No. But I don't have any tape. Man, I should have saved. It's okay. Man, why you gotta fake me out like that lunchtime? <laughs> Sitting here, slow as molasses, walking around. <laughs> totally. Yeah, I gotta say, it's kind of an unceremonious way to introduce the stalker. I think it's how we just freaking. Oh man, there's more shotgun ammo. Yeah, I feel like I should have been a little more aggressive with them. Looks like they like burrowed through these holes. It's interesting. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. That is a good amount of fungus. All right. Um, man, so much alcohol. Man. All right, that's cool. All right, 
so this is where we killed all these fools. I'm still gonna get that shoddy though, because I feel like... I wonder if I can go back and get the, my, um, my thing. My little bomb that I left behind. Is it gone? Where'd it go? Did someone run into it? Man, oh, I guess someone did. <laughs> I wonder if someone ran into my bomb. Brrr. <laughs> There's just giblets left. All right. Uh, thanks for hanging out, Cat Ariza. Have some good food. He ran into my bomb 10 times. <laughs> Thank you, Jay Cox. Musical theater friend there. Yeah, that is, totally answers that. I could do a cell block tango for uh, Last of Us 2. It'd be like, pop, six, with a six shooter, squish, or all the different weapons you kill things with. Hit. I get out of here. Damn, we didn't explore everything yet, though, yo. How did, man? How did I like? Okay, cool. Now we got a little bit, yeah. Can we at least craft some ammo? Abigail. <laughs> That's great. All right. I think I've explored everything here, although I feel like, I don't know, this feels like too big of a place to not have more collectibles. You know what I'm saying? So. What's up, Carlin Steve? Like not even, I keep thinking, I keep seeing safes, but I am incorrect. Oh, that's a cute wall pattern, little fishies. What's been going on here? Oh no, Fevin! What role are you gonna play, if you don't mind me asking? Because I would love to have been a uh, Mr. Cellophane, a Mr. Cellophane, or would I spend my name? Um, actually, I guess either, either the, the, the males would have been fun to play. Tsushima's awesome. <laughs> Is it too beautiful? I love it, Raito. So, on good authority chat, Raito says Tsushima is a, a really good game. So, you've got a vote from the chat to know that it is confirmed good. Um, I hopefully played. I still got to beat Sekiro, but I feel like any Souls game, it's going to take me a long time. Uh, all right, I guess this area is done. I can't help but feel like I'm missing something. But. All right, whatever. Yeah, Fossey's choreography, the um, the pigeon toe, the turn turn in was a trip. Though I do like the da -da 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 -da. <laughs> more of a mover, not a dancer. All right, uh, Merry Sunshine, awesome. Merry Sunshine. All right, I guess we're we're moving on then, since I don't know the hell else to get. What's up, Kellogg's? All right, um... I guess we're moving on, y'all. I, I don't know what... Did I... Oh, crafting training manual. 
<laughs> a survival guide for the silent majority. It's kind of wild. Um, what is my journal updated? Is that what happened? All right. Oh, well, thanks for dropping in, Kellogg's. Um, okay, well, maybe there's an opportunity to, to do more stuff. Whoa! Much Look at that river, though. It's loud as hell. Like in Seattle, yo. Are there any stalkers up here? Just watching the water rush by beautifully? Oh yes, Professor Fries. Grimgar will Grimgar will hurt ya. It's good though, dude. It's good. I hope you enjoy it. You gotta let me know what you think about it. Dude, Ellie. Great jump, girl. I'm doing that jump in parkour and that does not feel good. Any stalkers up your stalking? <laughs> Oh, that's cool, Jay. Maybe, um, I know you mentioned earlier you said you're hoping to grab a PS4. You're just hoping that that somehow morphs into a PS5, since that's coming out. <laughs> Alright, let's see if anyone's in here. Listen a little bit. Oh, balls. Okay. Head down to the street. Alright. Clickers, looks like. Shotgun ammo, dope. Alright, let's clear this way, I think. Ooh, end stalkers. Okay. I think. Let's make this easy on ourselves. Put it right here. Oops, that was dumb. Well, let's roll on it. That was the the wrong one, obviously. Didn't mean to didn't mean to do that. So set that there instead. Maybe we can take advantage though and uh Alright, well, fine. That's. That went horribly, you guys. Is it super loud? I'm sorry, Raito. I noticed that in my, my playthroughs, too. I, I click really loud. I'll try to play lower. Did that. What's up, bro? You coming for me? Come on, man. Why you gotta be like that? Oh, you dead, dead? Guess you dead, dead. All right. I make more so explosives. And training rookie noobs. Thanks for follow, Crocodala. Um, all right. There's gotta be a way out of here. Well, we used that. Uh, okay, I think we're safe now. Safe as safe can be. Um, but yeah, right, so I was remembering I posted some of, my, of our stream videos on my YouTube. Um, and I was like, God, my freaking 
PlayStation controller is so loud because I'm just constantly spamming to see if I can, if I'm grabbing anything that I'm missing. You know what I mean? Like looting wise. Because that's what this game can be is like something will light up for a second like that and you'll miss it if you aren't hitting triangle. Or just attentive, which both things I'm not the best at. Zenri, what up? Hola, que onda? Zenri in the chat. I hear them running around. Uh, rifle ammo too, bro. Come on. Okay, well, that's fine. Okay, I guess uh, let's see what's in the next room. Here we go. Ah, a squish, a squishy. Oh shit! No. Precision strikes, my friends. Precision strikes. Oh no. Some Tomb Raider shit going on right now. That was intense, y'all. Yeah, that, sorry, that was a lot. I apologize. Fuck Seattle. <laughs> oh, fuck Seattle. Um, yeah, that was rough, y'all. I thought I was going to have an opportunity to collect more things, but it's cool, it's cool. Let us... What's going on over here? Let's go look at, down at this poo poo water. Is there anything good down here? Nothing, nothing worthwhile. Ooh, what's, what's in there, I wonder? piece of pipe I can take? Yeah, dude. Okay, cool. See, I almost passed that up. That was more of a visual one there. I totally could have cheesed that, but... Alright, what else we got under here? Any treasures? Surely some people threw some medicine in the bathroom. <laughs> or in the... Flush some drugs down the toilet that I can use to level up. I think that's how it works anyways. Okay, I can't get up there. All right. <laughs> hmm. This is definitely poo poo pee pee water. Um, just to be clear, I'm gonna double check this. Uh, Emo, we were just, to catch you up after the save point, all we did was Check out the convention center. And now we are, huh, I think we're, we got swept away, swept away in the waters. Let's 
I don't know, Ashley. Um, in Last of Us 1, there was a fair amount of people still alive, but, you know, resource wars. Oh, shit! Uh, uh. Worked out well. Turns you into dust, bro. Spooked me. I didn't even, didn't even see it. But we will craft this. And these these Zeds aren't letting me um, take advantage of my my kit and my loadout. But I'm all out of uh, arrows and such anyway, so ain't no thing. Um, I haven't stealth killed anyone in a minute once those stalkers showed up. <clears throat> I should maybe focus more on doing that because that was a boon to have that have those stealth kills going. Sir, so, is that all that was? This wasn't the way to go ahead. All right. Well, oh, Karlinsky, uh, the kitties are coming at eight o'clock tonight, so I still got a couple hours yet. The gal who is bringing them uh, is coming way from like. San Antonio or something and they didn't get they just finally got on the road so don't worry I will I will share them with you when I when I get a hold of them oh maybe up this way certainly up that way there we go that's better that's more like it all right when in doubt, look up. All right. Oh, no! I did not No, I was going to slide so fast. It's all mossy and growth. Um, I was probably going to bounce. I was thinking, like, probably when the kitties get here. So I was thinking, like, seven or eight. Um, dinner is going to be pretty easy because I'm just I'm defrosting the... Uh, I don't know if you guys ever used Beyond Meat before, like the Beyond Burger, but I'm gonna make some spaghetti, so fry up some veg, fry up the meat, or the meat. Um, yeah, maybe I should go prone, huh? That might be better. There we go. What? Oh, come on. Hey, Fallen, how's it going? Oh man, I love our Discord, by the way, you guys. If you haven't joined uh, my Discord and you feel like joining a place where it's usually just good vibes, um, memes, and pictures of cats, and good vibes, <laughs> uh, you should join our Discord. <laughs> oh, you're making curry? Hell yeah, Zenry. What kind of, uh, what kind of curry are you making? You making some shiggin? Or some tof. Thanks for that, Crystal. Yes, there's so many good vibes. Did I mention there are good vibes? I don't know. I like it. It's can't believe it's a place that I like. Just kind of pop in, just to kind of read through and be like, "What is everybody up to?" All right, bye. Like I lurk in, in my own Discord. <laughs> How did I get strong, Jay? Um, daily practice. Daily practice equals daily growth. So I actually told myself I was gonna do my workout today. And if I ever miss my workout, I try to at least just do like 100 pushups like as fast as I can. And you can rest, obviously. You don't have to do them in one go, but like find your, your maximum and do it three times. Oh, did I just pull out my gun? Like. <laughs> I don't know if I meant to do that. Okay, yeah. Put that away, Ellie. Amber Skies TV Raid. Welcome everyone from Amber Skies TV. My name so the is Rico Fajardo. You may recognize my voice.
from shows like Black, Ho Black Clover, <laughs> Dr. Stone, Fire Force, and of course, My Hero Academia. But most importantly, you might recognize it from Six Flags commercials. <laughs> no, I'm all over the place. But um, thanks for the raid, y'all. That's a, that's, a, that's a cool raid, Amber Skies. I appreciate it. Um, I hope you guys are having a lovely Friday. Um, I feel like it's been several days already. Thank you for the follow, Amber Skies. Smash Tower Studio. A Swart. As Wart One. Or A S W Art One, probably better. Site like that. Um, yeah, I uh, hope you guys are having a lovely Friday. We're just playing some Last of Us Part Two. Um, I'm taking it slow as molasses. So, yeah, just taking time to chat about random stuff while we, while we get spooked together. So, yeah, if you're just hanging out, doing your thing, um, I might bring some, out of here. some kitties. I'm adopting some, uh, well, I shouldn't say I'm adopting. My, my girlfriend and I are, are uh, fostering some cats. Uh, but they're coming tonight, so I'll try to share them on stream later. And then also, we're playing uh, quite a few games, but this is the one that's kind of taken the lead. Uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake is also one that we're playing, so, yeah. <laughs> Defend the chat. <laughs> oh, what if big cats? That'd be dope. They have, um... They do have names. They're named after boxers. One of them's named Rocky. Where the hell did I end up? And the other one, I think, is uh, Ali. Like Muhammad Ali. Um, but we'll see. I think it's because they like to... So, we'll see. Oh, you finished it, Fevin? Nice. Um, the original Final Fantasy VII was one of my favorite games. Kyle and I talked about that game quite a bit. So... It's no surprise to me that he definitely displayed the the knowledge of lore that I'm like, he probably knows this game inside out. Because um, I think a lot of that game was sort of running around trying to find, you know, certain items or do certain things. Uh, but yeah. Your cousin's cat is Chonk, but so he loses weight. Oh, that's good. Training rookie noobs. I love Chonk cats. You grab their belly and you just kind of play with it like gelatin. <laughs> Thanks for the follow, Kaito, Kamiyama. Um, yeah, so many impressive things we are that squad. nearly at the hospital. Oh, thanks, Tech. All right, so I think we're like just about here. Um, gosh, I can't. I totally feel like I missed something, but it's okay. Let's keep going. Okay. <clears throat> Wait, where was the hospital? Okay, I'm there. There's the park. By the way, this is how I know this is how you all read maps. We all hold up our nine millimeter pistol to go, all right, I'm here. Look around. There's a bus stop. I could just wait for the train, take the orange line. So I want the orange line. One, two, three, four. How many stops? Oh, screw it. Let's just go northeast, southwest, west. All right. And my HUD is up, which means there's probably baddies. Oh wait, no, it's gone. All right, we cool. We cool, we cool. Oh man, this this Seattle uh, artistry right now, you guys, is just awesome. This is what Seattle would look like. It's just this lush, verdant forest. I freaking love it. Oh, thanks, Jay. That's high praise. There's a lot of really good actors in My Hero Academia, so I appreciate the kind words. I'm sure all of my pals would like to argue that 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 uh, statement with you, but I appreciate you. <laughs> That's very kind. Um, all right. So, Crystal, we need to go to the hospital because we're hunting down uh, a gal. There's a gal who did us real bad. I think we're trying to kill everyone on this hit list. Um... 
Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right. Beautiful verdant forest. Strange whistles. I don't like that. We're going prone, bro. Man, I am not liking this secret communication between bad guys. Where you at, bro? Where you at? So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. I know you're out here. I know you're out here. Thanks for the follow, Celeste. Oh, this is a great coverage, though. Like, you really can't see crap. They're not making any noise. Where are you at? Okay, now this is dangerous because they've dug a trench and you have to expose yourself. And I don't mean like get nude. I mean like, I'm gonna lose my cover. You know what I'm saying? So let's see if we can go this way. Ellie, really don't want you to get jacked, get ganked. All right. I knew it! I fucking knew it! I fucking knew it! Hello. Fuck you. Time to throw down, bro. Oh, you don't know knife? Knife, bro. Ooh, knife. Ooh, you get knifed. You're all getting knifed. Hang on. Give me that. That was poor planning on their part to all try to get me like that. Gosh. Jerks. I got a key. You guys notice I got a key? It's kind of cool. Um, let's make a molly. Dude, we got so much molly stuff. This is going to be great. You guys are as good as dead. Now this is where, this is like essentially what I've made my build for, was for, for this kind of combat. So let's make check our six, make sure that we're not getting ganked. Okay. Let's see if we can get some eyes here. Where you at, where you at, right there? I see ya. And it's done like that. Tech, thanks for the 100 bits. Oh, he's alerted. He's like, where'd you go, bro? You dead, bro? Yeah, he's dead, man. Should probably go investigate. That will help you a lot. Dick. As you can see, it benefited you a lot to check your comrade's dead corpse. <laughs> it sounds like talking, though. They're like, we... Man, I can't whistle. Like, it's expecting. Anyway, that's what they get, ass. Now I'm gonna put on a silencer. Steady. Wait, who? Oh, hello. You did die steady. You did real good. Everyone, keep checking out. Please come to visit your friend's carcass. See you, Kellogg's. Thanks for hanging out on your break.
Oh, that's okay, Tech. Thanks for hanging out. Um, oh, that'd be awesome, Cat Riza. I still haven't played Minecraft. All right, so we killed all those fools. Dude, I knew it. I knew the second I crawled out of that trench. I hate when I'm able to call it and the game won't let you do anything about it, but that's okay. All right, let's get a good look at your face. Oh, you did not, you didn't, I gave it to you good. I'm, I'm sorry about that. But uh, let's see what else we got going on around here. There's some little ice cream thing. Ice cream. Where did they all die? They all died right here. Oh, good. That is what I like to see. What? Okay, no. The axe that I currently have has way more uses. Where's your buddy? Oh, your buddy's around here too. <sighs> I stealth, you scream, you all scream for iced cream. Trans rights Mirio with a crown? Hell yeah. Way to go, Professor Fries. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw, uh, I posted it on my Instagram, but there's a wicked um, Mirio, like evil Mirio. I guess not evil, but like villain Mirio. And it's like Onyx. Um, Onyx suit and then gold, the gold lettering. It's pretty gnarly if you haven't seen it. Okay, big old fire going over there. Got one arrow. But it seems like everyone's already dead, no? All right, well, I'll play dumb. Let me save real quick, so I'm not being too silly. Yes, Tab. I am an actual oak tree, and so no one will find me. Immediately gets shot with arrow. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, here's the road to the hospital. Okay. Why is there uh, car fires though? I feel like that's a waste of fuel slash, do you know what I mean? Everything? Oh, dude, you got rocked. All this rifle ammo. Guess I should be using the rifle more. Did I make a scope for that yet? I don't think I did. I didn't. She. All right, it's all good. Ooh, what is that? Oh, that guy's got a perfect hatchet. He didn't even get to swing it once. Uh, scars. Fuck these people. Stay focused on why you're here. I got it. You got to admit, you got to love Ellie's moxie, man. She's just so focused. She's like, Wolf, F you. Scars, F you. Seraphites, F you. Maybe the Seraphites are the scars. Either way, Me in school, nice fam. <laughs> oh, y'all, just middle fingers. Oops, wait, what did I do? Okay, uh, what is that? Oh, that's the hatchet, I think. Yeah, I think this is the way to go. Let's just make sure that we collected all the things because I didn't really check over here much. It really is the best weapon, Tab, and I'm glad you, you have asserted me in that because, man. Stealthy, retrieve the ammo, accuracy's dope. I kind of wish it would have showed the, uh... oh, well, it did, didn't it? It showed, like, how far the, the arrow was going to go with the draw. That's pretty cool. All right. Um, imagine these are locked. I kind of, I'm nervous to try it, but I guess I should try. Yeah, okay. I just don't like it when it makes you go... Like once you commit, it locks you away, you know? Kinda hate that. Um, all right, let's, let's do it. All right. Nice. 
Nice place you got here. Be a damn shame if I knifed everyone in it. <laughs> oh. It froze, you guys. Oh, that was weird. I hit triangle and Ellie was like, I'm not sure I want to open that. Yes, there we go. See, I thought the rangefinder was gonna be was gonna show, actually show the trajectory of the of the arrow. I didn't really see it, but maybe are those owls, pigeons? What is that sound? <laughs> the knife threat. Oh yeah, I'm definitely channeling Toga. Get those knife knife vibes. Look at that. Look how sparkling clean that door looks. You know this is where somebody lives. No one no one has it that clean and lives in the apocalypse, bro. Should we go one by one? Let's finish let's finish uh, checking this little perimeter. Ooh, hello. The doppelganger. Oh. Kinda, kinda svelte and sexy. Doppelganger. Tech, thanks for those bits. Thanks for streaming. Really having a rough day today. Oh no! Can you guys get some hearts for tech? Give her some of that love today since it's Friday. For those of us who are, who are working those essential jobs and or jobs that we must do and or love to do. Um, here, I'll give you. I don't trust doors or bottles. Um, crystal. <laughs> but I'm sorry having a rough day. Hope that you can relax and chill and enjoy a little bit of the stream and get some work done maybe while I slowly make my way through Last of Us Part 2. <laughs> uh, real name unknown. Brain 60, bronze 60, affiliation none. A strange being of unknown origin, this alabaster-skinned humanoid with yellow eyes, definitely looks like an alien, is capable of assuming the shape of anyone you need him or her to be. The only catch, they need to make physical contact with the person you wish them to impersonate. The resemblance is near perfect, though if you look closely, you'll see their eyes give a glint of yellow after the transformation. So if you ever see a friend wearing sunglasses at an inappropriate time, you'd best be on your guard. Neutral. <clears throat> look at all those hearts. Hearts for tech, giving hearts for tech. You guys are, you guys are the best. Um, and yeah, I think, uh, so I was trying to contemplate other than remake what to kind of put on the, on the, um, the stove top, gaming stove top. Clearly I have cooking on the mind. I know you're about, you're about to make some, uh, some curry, uh, Zenry, Zenry, you're making curry and I'm, I'm, I'm about to make, uh, this sketty. So I'm definitely thinking about like a grill, but <clears throat> Kind of want to play a spooky game, but I, I didn't really like the the um, the White Day game. It was kind of boring. <laughs> I but I didn't get any jump scares. I looked online a little bit, and it was saying how like you have to go out of your way to find the jump scares. Not that I'm looking to get spooked, but I don't know. I thought it was going to be scarier. So anyway, near Automata. Oh, I have friends that are in that game. I, I got a game also, it's like a co-op uh, anime-ish kind of game. Actually, give me two seconds. I wanna see if I can tell you guys what it is. Have you heard of a game called, damn it, Steam, updating. Sorry, one second. Uh, once it comes up, I'll, I'll let you know. Um, oh yeah, Tab, Doki Doki was great. That was a great suggestion. And by the way, that came a suggestion like a few people back when we were doing uh, Ori recommended it i think like tortilla recommended it um demonic you may have too but everyone was just like you got to do doki doki literature club i was like why do we want to play this like simple simple game and yet okay have you guys heard of code vein um that one apparently is co-op and so <laughs> i can't i don't type fast actually i misspell a lot of things um 
So I might, there we go. Need some, uh, some of that Joel ammo. Oh no, the flowers have wilted. If this is, you know, if this is theater, that means our love is dead. But the, the flowers are white. They're white roses, which stand for purity. So that means purity has died. And Ellie, Ellie is on a mission of vengeance. So I think we're all, we're here to kick ass and, uh, and chew purity. And I'm all out of purity. <laughs> the famous words of Roddy Reddy Piper. Eat some snacks, get healthy. Yeah, wouldn't it? Let's see. All right, I guess. Was that me that touched that door? Shit. All right, hang on. I think we're still alone. Kick ass and break glass. Tick. So that's all. <laughs> Glass ASMR. I know. I know it's what you want. Oh, I hear whistling. I hear whistling. Did we get everything here? Man, I feel like I'm playing kind of sloppy, you guys. I feel like I'm missing stuff. Oh, Samalakra? Here, I'll look that up right now, Demonic. You're full of great suggestions, so I'm, I trust it. Um, Hannah recommended one, too, that I downloaded. Let's see, Samalakra. Wait, Samalakra? Is that it? Didn't come up. Let's see. Did I spell it right? Oh, Sim Simul. I did like Samalakrum. Man, Ellie, stop freaking out. So you're the newbie and training rookie. Mix. There we go. So wait, there's one that just came out, Simulacra Two. So do Simulacra One, or the Simulacra Collection, which is both of them. Um, one is better. Okay. We'll get one then. Put that in there. Oh, sorry if you hear audio. Did you guys see that, um, that game they announced? Where it's like, you play as a, you play as a mod. I think it's called Gamer Girl. This is weird, yo. It was all like full motion video kind of stuff. It was weird. Okay, thanks Ashley, thanks for hanging out. Um, let's see. Belle Daphine? Oh, I don't think it's her. <laughs> I guess we shouldn't jump down. Doesn't seem like the way to go yet. Should keep exploring. I heard that whistling though. Kind of pissing me off. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you're whistling. <sighs> These freaking, what do we call them? Scars? Oh, they're the pigeons. Should we shoot one? Is that rude? You think there might be an achievement? What do you think, y'all? Got a clear shot. They're very still. I think they're like messenger pigeons. All right. All right, let's see if we can get one. It's not really like let me line up too well. All right, well, I gave it a shot. It's okay, Tab. I got, um, I've got plenty of bottles. All right, I 
Atticus. No dice on that. The birds just work for the bourgeoisie. Oh no! All right. Get that glass ASMR. You love it. Ooh, hello, friend. You do not look healthy, bro. But I will read your letter in recompense. If anyone finds this note, my wife Paige is waiting for me to me back in the old conference center at Pike and Convention, right across from the brew pub. Please take her this medicine. She's pregnant and can die without it. I thought I could make it, but I've lost too much blood. I was sprinting through the woods, heard some whistles, and then an arrow pierced my side. I ducked into this place. Think I'm safe. Can't get any worse, right? Starting to feel cold. Stole all this medicine from the hospital. Should should have grabbed some blood, too. Bad joke, never mind. She'll tell you. I'm always making bad jokes. If you find Paige, tell her I went peacefully. Tell her I hope they all live happy lives. Hope that they live happy lives. Tell her I love her. And tell her that if it's a boy, don't name the kid after me. Go with the name we, the name we picked. Oh, that's so sweet. Wait, didn't we? Oh, that's right. I saw that group, so he didn't make it then. Well, naturally, I guess that's always kind of what you think, right? Damn it. Bro. Make some stove top. <laughs> End of the world. Repopulate. <laughs> Listen. I have solutions. <laughs> now hear me out. Repopulate. I'm like, wait, but isn't the world overrun with cordyceps? Like, we could all just explode with spores. Yeah, 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 yeah. But repopulation. <laughs> yeah, I think I got the letter from Paige lunchtime. Um, I think I did. Should I make this sharper? Nah. Yeah? Nah. We do more arrows. It's the right thing to do. We must repopulate! Repopulation complete. That sounds like something Protoss would say. Um, Oh, there we go. Craft more arrows. And I just craft some. Crafted some like a dumb. Dang it. All right. Well, got it. Power! Don't trust stairs. They're always up to something. Thanks, Tech, for that dad joke. <laughs> and thank you for the bits. Very kind. <laughs> Don't trust stairs. They're always up to something. <laughs> Lord. <laughs> Listen, man, repopulate. Like, I, I say make some more arrows first. Yeah, I'm excited to see how what the next season of Doctor Stone brings us. Um, I'm excited for my my lad Taiju to come back. There we go. All right, all right. What do we got? What do we got? Bedra Hospital Disaster Recovery Center. We're here, yo. No, we here. We got it. We got it. Don't need no hint. Just kind of taking our sweet time. No, I don't. I'm here, I'm going. Slowly, Ellie. Slowly. Slowly. Can I do photo mode here? What does it show? Oh, that's boring. Okay. Yes, I do. Is he dead? Ah, oh, he died. Hang on, let's, I wanna see if I can uh, cut him free maybe. Would that be cool? I wanna, I wanna try to cut him free. Like Robin Hood style. Oh, 
That was dumb. I guess we can't save him. It's kind of whack. All right. I know. Oh. Oh, man. That's what you get. I took that on the chin, though, you guys. I forgot I was out of a uh, out of bow ammo. Man, I love bow. Bow is so much better. dead as hell. You dead as hell. Damn, I really wanted to try to free that guy. But I guess it wasn't really possible. So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Where is he? Heard him say something. Uh, thanks for the follow. Is it AI Lab or? <laughs> You're the newbie and training rookie noobs. I was gonna say Alibi, but that's not right. Abs X. <laughs> anyway, thanks for the follow. And Joshua, where is it? Okay, there's someone up there coming down. Foolish. It's okay. Everybody makes mistakes. Definitely want that hammer. Oh, that's dumb of them, dude, when they call and respond. Because I can totally see them. That's real bad. Wasn't what I want to do. What the? Did he go up? He went up! <laughs> oh my god. God damn. I was like, where did he go? He climbed up above me. I was waiting for him to come around the corner. Like a fool. Eat these snacks. Get all strong. Oh shit! Oh no! Death! 
Wow, that was the first time I actually got the drop on me. I usually don't like check my six that slowly. So That's... you're the newbie in training with the noobs. This is the first time for everything. Like, she turns so slowly when checking her six. We're gonna go top to bottom. That'll probably help out more. Except for we gotta get this guy. top to bottom so we don't get the vantage dropped on us. Come on. Two of them. Alright. Fuck! What was that? Dude, that was garbage. Sorry, bro. Well, oh, Ellie's just sick of it. She's like, Gah. man. I'm not as good uh, in Last of Us One, man. I used to be able to really keep tabs on, and when you when you listen, it zooms in in such a way to where it's not nearly as effectual. It seems to be more effective to kind of like. Do little sweeps like that for listening. Okay, we're gonna finish him off though. There's a guy off in the distance. Let's take it low. What? Am I really full? Okay, let's go. There's a med pack there, though. Did I come in through this way? I think I came in through the bottom, right? Climbed up here. Yeah, this is where he came up. But I'm not sure if I came this way. Why don't you give me one of those nice... Uh, oof. That was rough. Seraphite whistles, that'd be really helpful right now. <laughs> I 
Music's good though. Keeping the keeping the pressure on. So much better use of ammo just to take him out quietly. It's simply simple and clean, you know? It's the way that they make you feel tonight. <laughs> oh, that'd be cool, Demonic. I mean, you can kind of already tell they have like expectant whistles damn man they were hanging everybody up yo vicious all right <clears throat> i didn't really get a good uh a good lay of the land really I was just sort of letting my, uh, letting their presence be what guides me in regards to where I'm heading, you know? So we could have crawled under here. That's kind of cool. Let's finish exploring the bottom. Well, we did, we did do this. So let's try over here. Oh, like Sayori, you guys. Doki Doki reference. <laughs> I understood that reference. Oh, another one. Another one. So many. Good thing they left a tasty treat for me to consume. It's very nice of them. Lots of bricks. I try to, Jay. Try to get some fitness in every day. It's good for the body and, and the mind. Helps actually keep me focused. Which, for me, if you don't know me that well, uh, sometimes I have some attention, attention issues, so. Clearing my mind and focusing on one thing at a time is really, really cool. Tag, you gifted a sub to Cybermax99. Thank you, Tag, for the gift sub. Appreciate you growing our little, our little community. Um, oh shit, where, where? So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Oh, he's over there. Oh, I see, bro. You're over there. Okay. He's like far over there though. Sounds came from over here. We got something. Well, that was foolish. Definitely shouldn't have gone that way. I mean sometimes take a chance. And sometimes you get stabbed by Ellie. Real bad. Fuck you. So she had eyes on us out this way. And that was over this, this way. Oh, so they're calling out, waiting for the response. There's no response. This is where a person should be hanging. Yep. Okay. We are on the right track. Hey, thanks, soybean. Oh. 
Oh, jeez. They're... Alert whistle. Ben! It came from over there! Oh, Ben. All right, you good. We good, we good. Everyone, relax. Bow down. Bow down to a true, true pimp. Ellie, master of nine millimeter. All right, um, it was tense for a little bit, a little bit there, guys. Felt as though things might not go our way. <laughs> I would feel bad about yelling power as I actually annihilate these fools. <laughs> Only because I don't know about their narrative yet. Like, I don't know what the... Oh, dude. Shoddy. Give me that shotgun. Yes. Machete? Man, it's so good when you take them out right away because then you get all their goodies. What was over here, by the way? We didn't even get to go all the way up. Oh, this would have been a really good vantage point. Damn it. I was trying to take the high ground, like Obi-Wan, but they kept getting the, the jump on me, so I had to play a little more crafty like this is oh, so we could have walked all the way around all right all right I get it I get it still waiting on the kitties I should be here in about an hour or so we've been going for about an hour and a half so we're doing we're doing good we're doing good The cats are in transit. Cats are in transit. I think in this dump truck. Showed it like a truck. What? What? Let's see. Um, me too, Tech. I'm excited to meet them. They're probably going to be a little shell shocked at first. So we're going to have to acclimate them um, before, you know, we're like playing with them all over the place. But. Yeah, once they're, once they're, you know, they're all good. I have no idea what their attitude's going to be like. It's, it's going to be a whole, whole adventure. Ooh, can you jump in there? I want it. I'm grateful that the discord is so full of so many so many critters it's a refreshing uh thing to always have a new salvo of kit kats Ooh, that is a bit better though because it's got a few more swings yeah we're gonna go with the pie bro Yeah, right. So I'm also allergic to cats, um, just a mild allergy, but I still, I still rub my face on them, put my human oils on them. They hate it, but I communicate to them that they are of my clan, that they are my kin. Uh, let's see. I think I need to go Mount C. Is that where I'm trying to head in there? Yeah, I don't know, Karlinsty. I'm not sure how Lucy's going to take it. I guess we'll find out. She's a pretty chill dog, so I feel like she's going to be fine no matter what. But can I break this? <clears throat> Guess not. I don't want to break anything if I don't have to. Come on, man.
You like how I'm being so uh, respectful of all this stuff? I know the answer is no. You'd rather me break everything, but that's okay. <laughs> I would like to grab all the things. What key is this that I have, by the way? I wonder if this is... Does, was that an appropriately timed question because I'm about to use it to open up this door? I don't see stuff. Is this a... Oh, it's, it is a cosmetic store. Okay, I was like, what the hell are these on the shelf? This feels like a place I could have I done some battle. And what the heck, dude? All of this stuff is super flammable. I can turn all of this makeup into freaking bombs. This is my video game logic. Alright, whatever. Fine. Alright. Well, what can we make? Um, Death needs some arrows. And yeah, why not? Oh, shit, man. Okay. That's fine. Oh, shit, man. Nice one. Oh no, I blew it. Oh. He's faster on the draw than me. Ugh. I'm also, I play so like conservative y'all. I just try to keep all of my ammo. All right, hey man. Why am I lagging on this, dude? What the hell? Is it because of the arrow in my shoulder? That was weird. Alright, now where are all those treats that I left behind? Alright. So I guess I didn't need that key? Why do I have that key? What the hell is that key for? I don't know what that key is for. Why is it it's still in my, my menu? Whatever, okay. Yeah, Professor Fries, uh, Michelle Rojas also plays this way. Um, <laughs> got 99 of every item, and you're like, no, I'm not going to use these items. I didn't need them as I'm getting freaking mauled to death by massive dude. Man, for having increased reload speed on this, I was like slow as molasses. She's like, <laughs> but I suppose I would do the same thing if I had an arrow in my shoulder. Put your arrow in my shoulder. All right, uh, yeah, I guess we're fine.
Oh, thanks, Mr. Miko. Yeah, it's so funny. I feel like uh, I'm not, I'm not playing the game somehow, like as as true to form. If I start using items all over the place, like when I started throwing those bombs, that's pretty rare occurrence for me. I thought to myself, well, if we're just having fun, I'm gonna throw a smoke bomb at this guy's face. Now, what I wanted to have though equipped was my shotgun, so I was kind of bummed out that this wasn't ready, because. That, that was my uh, finesse weapon, if that makes sense. Wait, do I have? Wait a sec. So you're the new okay, good. Training rookie noobs. Oh, we can craft them. Good. Thanks for the follow, Abby survives. Oh, and Viridian Arts and Stephimus Prime, all y'all, Sly Cooper. Um, the Sly Cooper. What am I missing? Oh my god. You eat all of it, Miss Mr. Shroom. How could you how could you not? You're not getting the full Oreo experience if you don't eat the cream and the and the cookie. My two cents. I never got that. When they had the commercials where the kids would like lick off all the cream, I was like, well, what are you gonna do with that cookie? And then, you know, I'd be like, I would have friends that would eat just the cream and be like, I don't want the cookie. I was like, well, you're dumb. Give me that cookie. Now, obviously, it's Corona times, so that probably sounds foul and really dangerous to you guys. But, like, I didn't give an F. I was a poor, hungry kid, and I'm going to eat that cookie. Yeah, or you're like, eh, eh. Gently twist it off, and then if you break it, and you break, you're trying to just get the cream, but then you mess up and you get the, you break off some of the cookie, and you feel like such an idiot in front of your friends. Damn it! I look like a ungraceful heathen. Can't even separate my cookies from my cream. Lame. Uh, ooh, let's make some more. I think. Oh, wait a minute. If we do this, nah, I like arrows. I don't know why I got even. Why do even gotta say it? Um, was this a thing where there's like a door down here and I missed it or something? Oh, I just didn't take the stairs. <laughs> Have you guys tried the pistachio cream Oreos? Pretty good. Okay, I think. Let me just double check really fast. They're quite good, Ari. I thought they'd be disgusting. Truth be told, they were good. Um, what's over here? Because I didn't really, I just sort of went upstairs. Oh yeah, didn't even go back here. Anything? Nada. Busted machine. Oh wait, is that? Oh, I thought that was a circle that like I could move this. I got super excited for a second. It's like, oh, hidden door? Nah, rego door. Pocky. All right, where we at? We good? Everything's good. Let's get under here. Definitely looks like a place we're about to do some fighting. Man, we're such a distance, yo. Oh, I saw those birds fly away. I mean, people are coming. People are coming up this way. I feel like we 
definitely should have a battle up here. So much, so many places to hide, right? How do you not have a battle on this massive, like, area? Um, I, I won't cosplay as that, Cadmos, because I don't know what that is. <laughs> but I have actually given thought to, if I got, like, super jacked, um, cosplaying as, like, uh, like, few from Xenoverse 2, paint my skin all purple. And uh, that'd be dope. Get a scythe. Um, or uh, like Corvus from Paladins. Because I think I could do that pretty easy if I grew my hair out. Just put some, put some gray. And then I could do the voice. A cooking stream? Oh, Lord. I don't know, guys. I'm not the best cook. This is where I'm the most vulnerable right now. If you do cooking by the book. We jumping? I guess we jump in. <laughs> What's underwater here? If you go to that boat. <laughs> okay, that's actually kind of funny, Mr. Miko. Just doing a Pop Tarts first. Yeah, we had deep fried Coke at the Texas State Fair. You guys ever had deep fried Coke? Coca Cola, not drugs. Just so we're, just so we're clear. What is all this over here? Ooh, and what is this over here? All the more interesting. So many places to explore. Okay, so we jump down here. Actually, yeah, let's finish up here first. And we will save. I was looking for drugs in the poo-poo water, but like, you know they were down there. I just couldn't see them. <laughs> That's why I was spamming triangle. I'm like, I know you're down here. Pills, pills here. Okay, what is, oh, Weston's Pharmacy. You guys, they're very, what? I heard that whistle. I heard that whistle, can't fool me. I know you're here now. Turn off my light. Ooh, dope, what is that? Bot Maandar. Bot Mondar, Neptune, uh, Brains 80, Brawn 60, Affiliation Spark. Once the solar system's most notorious pirate, oh, maybe it's a, that's an actual bird. Sounds like a regular bird. Uh, Neptunian Bahat Mondar became known for hijacking supply, resupply ships, threatening the nascent colonies on Europa and Enceladus, Encelala, Encelada, <laughs> Salad, the planet of Salad with starvation. Pursued by the future alliance into the asteroid belt, she flew her ship too close to a mysterious wormhole and found herself back in the 21st century. Though she initially enjoyed her newfound superiority, she quickly became frustrated by the limitations of our 21st century technology and sought out Spark. Her offer, her knowledge of the future in exchange for a way back to her own time. Villain. Oh, she's a villain? But she's all, like, sexy. Dang it. That's fine. Yes, bad, bad girl. Stupid. What's this? What's this? Good handwriting. Tom, I keep hearing gunfire at odd hours. We have no one to protect us from this crazy cult. We can't wait for the wolf to find us. We have to trek to their base and join them. I've started stashing supplies in the safe. Heading out to scout the best route. We'll be back with a plan ASAP. Be careful, MK. Almost forgot. The code is 385523. Okay. Hot 
mountains are always evil, man. Sucks. That's okay. There's balance in life. If you do cooking by the book. Hang on. Did we get everything? I feel like this store especially, I shouldn't I shouldn't be missing like I want that to be a thousand medicine. <laughs> What's up, Tortilla? Um, I didn't mean listen. I'm being a being a sloppy Sam right now. I'm not gathering the things I should be. Well, okay. Not enough for stability, huh? One more part. I think there's one more laying around here. We'll find something. <laughs> Mr. Miko. The ass master. <laughs> you can make people, you can control the posterior, the glutes of anyone within a 60 foot radius. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. So it's like, whoa. Let us, what was it again? 35 something blah. Damn it. Mm, So gratifying when you hear that slightly lower click. Check. Really? Come on now. All right, well, let's heal then, because I haven't used the health pack in forever. We're gonna use it, we gotta use something, right? Man, I already got explosive arrows. Okay, well. How many parts do we have, though? What's it say? 60. Oh, damn it, one more part. That's okay. Well, I wanna get stability for the bow. But it looks like that's not going to happen right now. The things I can do, though, are revolver. Oh, I don't have reload speed for that. I thought I did. Stability scope. I am oh, going man. To be your hero. Oh, Sun Eater 96. Thanks for that tier two sub. Yo, thanks. Appreciate you. Something that's brighter than the sun. I know. Sun Eater. What do you think um, if Amajiki has some crazy big fight, what he will have to eat in order to bring about some crazy transformation? Eats a little piece of Deku's hair, a la, a la All my. Looks like I was just thinking to myself that big locker in the back room I kind of get a little nervous so that so I'm get a little claustrophobic sometimes and I think to myself what if like you got trapped in one of those big safes like and someone forgot the combo oh my god that is horrifying yo horrifying Like there should be, I mean, I'm sure there's like, there's gotta be a way, right? Like if you're inside for a way to escape, like a, an oh shit button, you know, inside. Anyway, like it gives, it gives makes me uh, anxious thinking about it. My shoulders are like, Ugh. 
forbid that every day is leg day. <laughs> All right, let's... Okay, so we checked out this building. This place is scouted out. Um, so we checked out West Ends. We didn't check out the south area and we came in. I didn't really swim too hard. Um, yeah, it seems like it has to be something edible, but he did eat some of the crystal of one of his enemies and was able to manifest it with other things, which is pretty rad. He can, like, synthesize it with his body in, in wild ways, so. I mean, if he can do that, then, I mean, he probably has, like, imagine if he had, like, just some, some jewels. He could just eat some diamonds. But then that's kind of similar to, uh, to Kirishima, right? Oh, shit, I'm out in the open, and I hate this. Nothing worse than being out in the open with a bunch of snipers around. Doesn't feel good, man. Gonna tell you, doesn't feel good. Sato should have been dead long ago. I'll be sure to tell Chris George that. He does burn off the sugar. The sugar. I feel like him, he and um, Fat Gum would be super tag team, yo. I'm not sure why, because I feel like Sugar Rush, you know, his thing is specifically with sweets. But, um, yeah. Are those my shoes? <laughs> That's weird. All right, well, I guess we're moving on. Fat gum's, fat gum is always hot. Oh shoot. Someone escaped and Isaac's not happy about it. They talking about Abby? Sounds like what it is. Oh shit, dude's right there. <gasps> oh, he's listening to music. That's sad. Shouldn't have done that. But you left your PSP. I'm 
compelled, compelled to dance this music. I think we found our new photo, everybody. There we go. This, this is what Last of Us is about. I think. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I need like a dramatic angle though. I, need, I wish I could do like, maybe not. Yeah, we need, we need camera mode, custom. And we get, I wanna see like Ellie's face illuminated by it. Well, we'll get one that's very dramatic overhead, like, like that, and zoom out a little bit, yeah. There we go. And then, field of view is a little weird. Probably should zoom it out a bit more. Well, no, that's pretty good. Rotate it some. And then, oh, can we roll it? There we go. That's what we're talking about. And then depth of field. No, we don't need that. Um, brightness, we good. We good. Filter, nah. And yet, actually, let's hide. Let's let's just hide Ellie. No, that's dumb. All right, uh, frame. Nah, nah. It's better like that. And then logo, top right. That's it. That's the picture, y'all. This is this is what we we play games for. We try to capture art within art. I guess I'll call it what? Inception. Now what's key about this is if we can get it, if it glows on Ellie's face, I don't even know what I'm gonna believe right now. Like, I need to know if. Oh, it does. <laughs> it's kind of morbid, but like, oh, I wish I could, oh yeah, 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 there we go. You guys, this is great. Oh man, that's gnarly. <laughs> I'll go uh, plus one PSP. Or I'll go, <laughs> hang on. And if we're doing this old style, uh, you know, RPG, maybe like that. Sony PSP acquired. Because I think it is one. I feel like an asshole if it's not. Anyway. I love it. It's a Vita. I'm an ass. <laughs> it's fine. Thank you for the heads up, Soybean. It's still cool. Ellie said, yoink. I wonder if I can, let's see. I need that ammo. Vita, it's a Vita. Oh, that's the, that's the face right there. That's what we want. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We got this, we got this, yeah. <laughs> I'm so sorry, y'all. This is great. <laughs> I'm having a great time on Last of Us Part 2. <laughs> it's all in the, it's all in the face. The facial reactions. Um, 
I should be like, oh wait, it's a Vita. I'm leaving it. <laughs> Discard. Is that too cold? That's fine. Anyway. Oh, that's funny. Oh, tell Sophia I said, what's up? <laughs> it did have good games, Jopsa. I was just saying that to be to be a jerk, to, to match Ellie's face. It didn't have to be this way. over here, I wonder. What that? What is that? Uh, yeah. Give me that shit. Wait, no. Actually, mine's way better. I shouldn't say way better, but it's got a blade on it. And I have an affinity for my, my craftables. Know what I'm saying? Even though that wrench, that wrench probably hits just so hard. Ah, and they're gearing me up too. All right, well, that's good. I did say shave, Jason. Um, I had a big old furry beard and I got tired of it getting in my mouth and I had auditions for things. And that's that's how the cookie crumbles. That's how the Oreo crumbles. line of sight him. This is actually really not good for me. Alright, let's see. Doggo. But, oh no! That was the saddest thing I have ever heard. He called out the dog's name as I shot it. Oh damn. That hurt me, y'all. I didn't, I've never, I don't think I've ever killed one of the, of the attack dogs and had them respond like that. <sighs> Damn. Bear! Oh, oh, that was rough. Damn. Uh, well, hey, just to be fair, Bear was trying to take my face off. So, um, you know, an eye for an eye makes the world go blind. So, do not speak the language of violence. Because otherwise, that is what's going to be communicated forevermore. And yes, indeed, that was not very plus ultra of me. Uh, so, rip. Rip bear. All right, um, let's figure out who's next.
So you're the newbie in training? Got him. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet, 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 quiet. Shia LaBeouf. Quiet, quiet. I mean, he's looking for me. He's trying, man. Does anyone see her? Christ, nobody's found her yet. Not finding anything. Shit, I didn't realize there was another dude over here. Sorry, bro. I got your doggo, and I'm gonna get you. Let's have a little conversation, huh? Come on. Stop it. All right. Calm down. Actual cannibal Ellie. So you're the newbie and training rookie new. Let's hide here for a little bit. Oh, a baseball bat just hanging out in the back like a present? That's great. <laughs> Actual cannibal Shia LaBeouf. Um, so it looks like one of them's over here. I can kind of see them over there. Someone's typing. Well, it looks like I've got the uh, the edge on the long the long side now. This side of the building seems clear ish. There's my lucky bat. All right, I guess we should just take them apart coming from this side of the building. Looks like three of them, four of them, maybe. Oh wow, you got it laid out. All right, let's see. Gently, shh, shh, shh. go quietly into the dark. I think we can probably. They're all spread out, so that's good. Hmm. Oh, I got eyes on me for a second. Dumb of you. Is that it? 
all alone, bro. Oh, almost, uh, almost checked his six. Almost went the right way. God, that's terrifying, man. I'm a ter. Look at that. Look at that. Like, oh, that's like that is not encouraging, yo. Like, if I'm, if I'm just saying, if I'm like the bad guy, and I'm like. That, although I'm not sure if that's actually a clean hit, that kind of is like, that kind of to me looks like I, I sort of missed. So you're the newbie and training rookie new. Maybe I'll entitle this one haircut. Let's see. Um. Um. Yeah, it's probably fine. No refunds, Karen. <laughs> oh, you said no refunds. <coughs> oh man, that's awesome. Oh, hey, too too lit for you. All right. Um, yeah, not without a mask. <laughs> So you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Oh shit. He like actually almost had me there. Bro, you like had several chances. I am going to be your hero. Oh, thanks for the sub, Mad Hatter Gal. Appreciate that. Very kind. Thanks for supporting the community as I take these these kind of hilarious uh photos. Um <laughs> it's kind of sad uh, but but still funny kind of funny all right um let's see if we can find a fun filter for this eh? all these are like all the filters kind of suck like just to be fair i'm like i'm not sure i'm feeling them yeah i think none is the way to go here That's good. <laughs> I don't know what I should caption this with. <laughs> Where's season five? <laughs> Where's season five of MHA? <laughs> I'm just gonna say, where's my manga? Sorry I'm blowing you guys up, by the way, because I know for those of you that follow me on Twitter, I'm just blowing that up. That was a good one. Uh, all right, all right. Quiet. I'm just curious. Ooh. Like, come on, man. Look at the blood trail. detail y'all it's just it's just crazy he looks kind of happy I'm gonna say give season 5 <laughs> seems so violent though like I'll say it soon All right, I probably shouldn't blow up my Twitter with all these like just horribly violent images, so enough of that. All right, um, I think we did that pretty good. That should be everyone, yeah? I mean, it feels like everybody. I mean, I'm just gonna start running around. If someone wants to fight me, I'm gonna blow them away. All right, tag. 
Yeah, I probably should make that dinner soon too. Whenever the the Kit Kats arrive. Okay, front of the building. Can I squeeze through here? Very cool. Okay, looks like there was an, another way we could get in here. Kind of. Oh, neato. Did you already finish, Miss November? Whoa, look at this. I should have been sniping this whole time. Oh, I didn't realize. That's how I killed that guy? I shot him in the arm? It's kind of a crappy shot. Oh well, I did my best. It's up there, I wonder. Um, can't get there? Eh. Um, thanks again for the love. I'm feeling tons better. Also, Rico, I can see through your shirt. That's right. This is the better to so see you can see the game, you guys. Now you can see all of Ellie. All of Ellie. Thanks for the uh, bits, by the way. Zach. What now? Okay, it wants me to go down that way. That's good to have a waypoint. It's a poor game. It's probably like, this guy is so lost. I'm like, I just want to collect everything, is all. Yes, that should be like, oh, I'm sorry. Did you post spoilers? Yeah, I really did try to make a lot of my my screenshots spoiler free, other than of course, seeing the bloater, which is played by my buddy Kellen Goff. So I had to show, show that off as much as I could. Um, Cause that was just fun. Mm. This is not a good time. Did not have a good time. Ah, there we go. That is what I am talking about. Um, okay, we maxed out that. Trap mines, faster crafting, craft smoke bombs. More health, more smoke bombs. Uh, and this is gonna be improved molotovs, which is kinda badass. Oh, more explosive arrows? I'm sorry, this is where we're going. Yeah, I didn't know it was a National Voice Actor Day. Uh, Ashley. <laughs> okay, I think I've pretty much explored everything. Um, I'm always reticent to go on when I'm kind of, when I'm streaming, uh, just because I know I, I leave stuff behind sort of willy-nilly, like that stuff. Dang it. Um, but I feel like we're pretty geared. You know, I'm not, I'm not concerned about uh, running out of supplies, so all this stuff. Totally, Jopsa. All right, let's see what this new area is about. All right, because you did remind me of the um, of the Kit Kats, I want to make sure that that's going all right. So I. See, it used to be, by the way, when you'd hold listen, it would show the the uh, generator loudly up making a lot of sound, which could then mess up your tracking for, for bad guys. So you would want to like turn it off so you could hear them better. Um, or other, sorry, like interference sounds or things you don't want going on. But um, what I'm gonna do real quick is take just a quick bio break, check and see about the, the kittens. And uh, yeah, I'll be right back, y'all. I'm gonna turn on some rain for you. Let's get some beautiful sounds of the rain. And uh, I, meh, there you go. If you can hear that a little bit. Is it too quiet? I feel like it's too quiet. 
that better? There you go. All right. Bye, break. Be right back. Oh man, y'all, I'm so excited to get a uh, red laser for the cats. It's gonna be, it's gonna be really exciting. <laughs> so the cats will be here in 30 minutes. Um, 
Pretty excited. Pretty excited about it. Red laser is is the key. Um, so yeah, I am pumped, and I'll probably uh, like abrupt abruptly end the stream, or at least pause it um, when uh, when they get here, because I want to make sure. Like they're still kittens, guys. They're they're very young, and the, we're sheltering the mom as well too. Um, so I want to make sure everything's kind of golden before I start showing them to y'all. You know what I mean? Um, but it'll be fun. And I think maybe I can, uh, I can set up like a, like a kitty cam. Cause we have this back room that is still getting flooring and stuff in it. Um, and it's a big open room. So maybe I can just set a camera there and you guys can watch these fools run around. That'd be cool. Anyway, here's to that. Here's to kitties. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Also, massive loaf of bread, which is essentially what I'm drinking because I'm just drinking this beer. So, some Parmesan bread that I purchased sucks that it came in this big old thing of plastic, but it's the price for apparently really good bread. So, clink. Ah, just live off of carbohydrates, y'all. Oh. oh, yeah. That's uh, some good ass bread. All right, let's kill some people. <laughs> Man, I'm excited for the cats, yo. <sighs> Carbs, Righto, are energy. And if you turn that energy, if I do 100 burpees after eating this loaf, I'll be in good shape. If I don't do anything, my body will be like, sweet, let's save this for later. Put it, put it here. <laughs> All right. Carbs are super yum, Zenry. I'm with you. You think as I do. Entaro Adun. Door barricaded door with some alcohol um uh i shouldn't make some can i not make any balls okay i have one arrow let's use our silencer i think what's going on in here huh the heck is going on in here Too, too quiet, y'all. I'm gonna turn this up a little bit because it is too flippin' quiet. I don't like it. I don't like any part of this. But we will explore it. It's a note. Let's stand up and read it after being so stealthy. Supply list, musts, alcohol swabs, iodine swabs, woven gauze, gauze bandages with tape, muslin bandages, latex gloves, face mask, morphine, and naxos, naloxone, bandages, safety pins. There's no gel burn dressing and no blankets. If available, introsis infusion kits, hemostatic dressings, whatever you can find, blood pressure cuff, antibiotics, penicillin, levofloxacin, Levo, levofloxacin, amoxicillin, whatever you can find. Stretchers, I think we got them all. Trauma shears, rapid application splints, open chest injury seals, whatever's left, two airway. Be sure to dig into corners of the second floor. There are still rooms we haven't opened that might have things worth taking. Don't go near the lower levels. You know where we're gonna end up falling into the effing lower levels. That's already happened several times. Like, I don't know how to, I don't know how to tell you guys this, but spoilers, we're probably gonna fall into the lower levels. <laughs> Take that big old German Shepherd outside, soy. Yeah, def, definitely Kellen. Kellen's gonna come hang out. He's welcome, I appreciate him. He can come hang out. 
but I need to make sure. Definitely not a glamorous photo mode. Yeah, I can't handle it. It's too much. Packing supplies, okay. Well, maybe if you posted more guards, Abby would still be in herself. The fuck was Abby here? I'm not stupid. You're gonna tell us where she went. When Isaac talks to us about this, I'm gonna say what I think happened. <gasps> Knock yourself out. I've got work to do. Nora! I'm not going down for her, man. Ellie, that was a really good landing. Clean. I think we can make some arrows. Arrows. Dope. Feeling better already. Oh, wait. See, I would have walked right by that. These fools. Over this door. Hey Luigi, welcome back. What's up, Hannah? Wait, what? Why is that locked? Do I have to follow her? Damn it. Oh no, your knee started acting up again. I'm sorry. Don't scream. Put that shit down. What do you want? I want all your lives. Abby was here earlier. Where's she? Where'd she go? I don't know. You shoot me. The sound will have every soldier come running. I have three Molotovs. I think I can take them. You'll still be dead. <laughs> Tell me where she went and I'll think about letting you go. Could have killed you. Maybe you should have. Or maybe you should have stayed the fuck out of Jackson. Where's Abby? You still hear his screams? What? I hear them every night. Yeah. Yeah, that little bitch got what he deserved. Fucking ah! You're stupid, Ellie. You're stupid. Chestcatcher! Somebody, please! Hang on. I think I can get her. Somebody, please! Over here! Oh, what? It wouldn't let me fire! No way. It wouldn't let me shoot her, you guys. Ooh. 
Kiss me love this game. <laughs> Somebody, please! Over here! Did you see that? <laughs> I was like, that's a headshot. Game's like, no, no. <laughs> it's alright, it's fine. We'll just deal with it. Keep on going. Hang on, wait, wait. I don't wanna, I wanna be like right on top of her. Let's see if we can do this. Somebody, please! Over here! Nora! You can't escape this! I know parkour. Girl. Damn it! Oh my god, move. Please go. Shoot her! Stop! No, no, no! The fuck did she go? Should have threw a molly. streaming started playing chrono trigger music oh, some dramatic shit sorry i got all loud over there y'all okay let's uh oh this is such a good picture so you're the newbie and training rookie news okay uh let's see here okay i can't i'm not gonna post this one but that's that's just a beautiful picture y'all yeah that was um uh what is the Middle Ages, or not Middle Ages, the, um, ah, uh, what is it? Dark Ages. The Dark Ages, uh, anyway, okay, um, see what happens. Like that? Let your turn, girl. Take her out. Not so. The fuck's the power doing on in here? Doesn't matter. Find the trespasser. You're doing great, y'all. You're doing great. Stealth kill him real good. Let's see. 
guess we can actually... The uh, spores are so thick, it's hard to see them. Thick. running those running sections where like you pass up all this great stuff I assume there's great stuff that's just the the, the looter in me that wants to get all the things all right let's let's get geared I'm glad I used some rifle ammo man these little Places to sneak in and hide or slide through. Gosh, they're so helpful. <laughs> glass. I like the way that sounds. Smashing that glass. I really thought there'd be some medicine here. Or not medicine, but like pills. Some pills here to level up. But alas, it looks like we gotta do some improv motor jobs. What's the next one? What do I get from the next guy? Uh, more trap mines. That's actually pretty cool. What were they? Oh, dude, look at that guy. That's pretty cool, man. Oof. Yeah, bad things happen there. That was like, ugh. That's rough. cool oh sorry the pills here is from a game uh called left for debt thank you taylor d rage for the the assist there four player co-op game which actually i would love to play with you guys at some point if we can grab a, a few folks and and do a squad based shooter of killing all the zombs it's fun all right um. Okay, so it looks like we've collected all the thing. Wait. It says as I freaking walk by something. All right. We're good. We're locked and loaded. Feel oh, wait. I'm like hurt. What the heck? Let's heal a little bit. gotta be breathing spores at this point. Yeah, you're not feeling too hot, are ya? This game's actually feeling like a little too real with all the corona. She has got the COVID and she is not feeling good. She probably thinks she's like safe back here because there's no way, right, that anyone could come get her. Why are you always hiding? You always hiding. Oof. I 
I'm going to watch you turn. And then I'm going to take you out. <laughs> Ellie's like, Corona, huh? Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> Yo. Hi, Nora. Oh, my goodness. This is like terrifying for her. <coughs> so you're the newbie and training rookie noobs. Oh man, this is an intense moment. Uh, thanks for the follow, Saturnuzu. And also Wilfrid, Wilfredo Delgado, one, two, three. All right. Here's Ellie, totally. <coughs> You're gonna be all right. You're gonna be all right. You okay? Mm. Where's Abby? <coughs> Breathing's worse. Yeah, I'm good. Where's Abby? You hey, firefly? <laughs> there are no fireflies anymore. Oh yeah, because Joel killed them all. Where's Abby? I'm fucking dead anyway. Why would I tell you anything? <coughs> because I can make it quick. Or I can make it so much worse. Think about what he did. How many people are dead because of him? chance oh that shot I'm not giving up my friend I respect it totally respect it god that's a great shot I think this is what they were showing in like the trailers, right? I didn't need a whole bread. I, I left some of it. That was all. Let you turn. Breathe. Breathe. Protect your friend. You got it, Ellie. Breathe it out. This is the moment before. It's like the thing you don't want to see coming at you. Breathe, girl, breathe. Let her turn. Let her lose her mind. Then take her out. Don't do it, Ellie. Don't do it! I know, I'm praying for Ellie to stay frosty. I guess I have to do it. I am going to be your hero. Thanks for the sub, Captain Dunch. Ah, it sucks. All right, here it comes. 
How do you feel? Music. Man. It doesn't... It doesn't let go, does it? Just showering it with, with, uh, with Ellie pictures. That'll do it. Yeah, sorry about that, y'all. I tried to turn it down a bit. I'm coming in really hot. I used one health kit while I was out there. Are you okay? I killed 38 people. Thank you for what? She's hiding out in the, uh, in this aquarium. Okay. They're here. Oh, they're here? The, the kitties are here. All right. Be right back. Gotta say hi to the kitty cats. All right, be right back.
Sorry I'm taking so long, y'all. The woman brought, like, a full-on crate, and the kittens are there. They're adorable, but she's, like, having a little bit of a, you know, kind of farewell moment. It's, it's very sweet. So, anyway, I'll be right back. <laughs>
they're here, guys. They're, I put them in my bathroom right now. Um, so I put them in my bathroom right now. We're saying goodbye to, um, to the gal that drove them here because we, we have a lot of um, kind of just pet stuff we need to do um, and get and talk about because we need to fix the mom cat because she's still really young yet and the two kittens are also not quite old enough to get fixed, but you know, so we're just trying to strategize a little bit. Um, but I'll, as soon as I can, I'm going to show them to you guys and thanks for hanging in there. <laughs> uh, I figure we'll probably play a little bit more Last of Us and I'll try to see if the kittens are cool to show you guys and then I'll show them to you. So thanks again for your patience. I'll be right back. <laughs> They're super cute.
Oh, holy smokes, y'all. Um, so you can probably hear them already in the other room. The mom cat is clearly um, still uh, very much in heat. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> and the keeps like pushing her tail to the side and like presenting herself. And it's like, oh, that's you're that's sweet. But she's very affectionate, consequently. So that's a, uh, uh, <laughs> that's like a, a thing. The kittens are super cute, but also very tentative. Um, I kind of went to go, you know, pet them, and they're like, uh, uh. so I want to make sure that they they feel really comfortable before I, I you know, go, hey, look, look at this thing. Um, so I'm gonna let them, I put the, the whole crate in our bathroom um, and uh, put a few toys in there, got their litter, got their food going. The, the mom cat has like a special diet that she needs for her kidneys. Um, and the, the, kit, the kittens are still like barely going from soft food. Like the mom still, I think was giving them milk up until like a little while ago. So this, this is gonna be an adventure for us. Um, probably gonna keep them in the in the bathroom for like a day you know make sure they feel really comfortable with that and then let them into the second like living room area and like our, our bedroom but um you know this stream setup uh, you guys haven't seen the back of it but there's cables everywhere and if you know cats um uh they will chew cables and the last thing i need is a little kitten biting into some heavy gauge cable and it's going like and flying across the flying across the room so uh yeah so what I'm, i think i'm gonna do is just to just to be safe um just to be safe about it is i'm gonna keep them keep them away for a while um we're fostering them just for for a few weeks um but we are gonna end up keeping one of them so we're either gonna keep rocky or ollie um and our uh friend who uh works with um hope at her one of her organizations is gonna adopt the other kitten so yeah it, it should work out well hopefully everyone had, ends up getting a home but uh yeah it's um it's gonna be an adventure y'all and i'll try my best to showcase them but right now even like i wish i could have shown you um ollie was like captivated by the doorstop it was like ding 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 so it's um Everything's very new, very, very new. Uh, level one, level one kitten. So uh, I'm excited. I love cats. I'm so excited to actually have some. It's actually still not quite hitting me quite yet just because they, they just got here. But um, yeah, it's gonna be fun. I haven't had an animal in a long, long time. And so this will be delightful to have three um, and Lucy, but Lucy's like Aaron's dog. So, um, even though she's around and she's a big old loaf, uh, we're gonna have three three Kit Kats to, to run around now and be, be full of fear <laughs> of Lucy. Even though Lucy's the most relaxed creature in the world. Um, that's exactly right, Jopsa. I need to, get their, need to get their XP up. So if you guys don't mind, I was gonna play a little bit, uh, see how far Hope gets with um, with leveling up the kittens a bit. I'm concerned though, because they're so small, you guys, they can totally squish their small bodies under the bathroom door. Like they can escape, I think, pretty easy in most of the, how the, the, the rooms in this house. I need to find something that I can like stuff under the door so they can't go because you know, cats are liquid. So this is gonna be, yeah, they're tiny, Carlin Steve. The mom is tiny. They're all very small. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna probably get some more towels. You read my mind, um, demonic. Uh, yes, and uh, and obviously introducing Lucy. We have this cool partition. I'll stream for you guys, uh, like on Instagram or something when when I have them meet through the door because that will be funny. I'm sure Lucy will just be like, uh, it's gonna be really goofy. Um, but yeah, yeah, liquid kittens. I'm a little little concerned, but let's. Yeah exciting everybody sorry i kept waiting for so long but i'm gonna wait and see if, if uh i think i can probably show you the mom the mom's really cute 
and she's very affectionate. Oh my god. That's incredible. Sorry just to take you right back in and immediately like do this, but damn. That's the that's the face of uh, of just fatigue, being tired of of hatred and vengeance, and she's also trying to reconcile, I think, what Joel did and everything. And of course, it probably was just really stressful because I kept her there for five minutes staring at this woman. <laughs> um, I'm not vegan, Ashley, but I my my partner is, so I try to eat as vegan as I can. Um, I like to think I'm making like a transition, but like I'll eat vegetable vegetarian for like a week and then in the middle of nowhere i'll have like bacon and eggs so i'm not the best if there's a good or bad but i'm an omnivore at the moment so ellie don't cry don't cry ellie vegan food yeah it's all in how you make it it's all in preparation i'm done Oh, that arrow wound. Girl. Sorry. That's just like a... I know they do. I told you they would. They're liquid. Put a towel under the bottom. Okay. Stream is saying put a towel. Specifically demonic Kitsune 87 says put a towel. <laughs> They're trying, Karlinsky. They're already trying. <laughs> or pillow. This is emo Corex. I made her talk. Was it the first time Ellie tortured someone? Oh man. So much pain, y'all. Sorry I'm in the way, Dan. Two years earlier? Two years earlier? Hold the phone. Did Ellie go back? To the place where Joel like murdered everyone. Oh man. Left a lot of stuff behind. that music it's all dissonant and stuff By this time tomorrow, we will have altered the course of history. I guess that's the part of Ellie they needed to, to work on. Um, Ashley, what is this? 
So that's a really good question. Is Joel a good or bad guy? That's really what this this series is about. Um, making hard choices, you know, like why we do the things we do, how bad, bad guys are born. I think at the beginning of Last of Us 1, it's no spoilers, but Joel's done some really bad stuff after uh, he loses some family at the beginning of the game. Um, to survive, maybe to get vengeance in some weird way, you know? Um, but he definitely passed on a lot of so you're the a lot of killing noobs. and a lot of pain <laughs> so you meet him at a point where you're like yeah i've got a effed up history but then he has this story of kind of um salvation in that he meets ellie and so they have a whole adventure together and he finds essentially new family in a way in that reestablishes his balance i'm speaking really broadly by the way because i don't want to spoil the game for anyone because it's super fun um and powerful but uh yeah in last of us 2 you know we're reconciling the past like what came with the past oh thanks for the follow cali cat mcgee um in fact i have and i, I think this is a, a very apt time since you asked um that beautiful question ashley blessing because I got the Ellie edition, I got this awesome placard uh, from Neil Druckmann, who has worked on, you know, Walking Dead and obviously Last of Us. And it's this beautiful little lithograph. I actually have a lithograph. Um, well, this is a tiny little art card, but I have a lithograph of Ellie with a, a carousel and it's all lit up and she's looking at it in wonder. And this is like, I feel the the next part of that was with her on a horse and she's more grown up. But Neil says, what would you do if someone you loved was the victim of a cruel and violent act? I think very appropriate for current events with Black Lives Matter, etc., etc. How easily could one's mind tip toward violent retribution? How far would you go to bring the people responsible to justice? If you were successful, how would it change you? Would you ever be the same? With The Last of Us Part Two, we set out to create an experience that explores these difficult questions, the darkest sides of human nature, and the vicious cycles of violence that we witness in the world around us on a daily basis. The result is a game crafted by hundreds of developers that push themselves to create something more than mere entertainment, a game that we're incredibly proud of and that we hope will enthrall you and challenge your own views of justice and empathy. Those are two, like, those are the key words in the textbook that are bolded, justice and empathy. On behalf of everyone at Naughty Dog, we wanna thank you for embarking on this journey with us. Um, but Neil Druckmann, who directed it, uh, this is this by far, I think, next to that dope backpack, um, is the thing that I was so excited to get. Um, the vinyl was great. I haven't even fired it up yet. I have it set up in the, in the second living room. Maybe when the kittens are all out and about, I can, I can spin it up one day, but I love it. I love that we they put together a game like this where, you know, you can say Joel's a good guy, but you can also easily, within the same breath, say he's a very, very bad guy. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. It's, it's the conversation, you know? But anyway. Uh, oh, that's your bestie? Hello, Callie Cat McGee, bestie of Tech Kitty. <laughs> Just you wait. Um, okay. The growth has clearly mutated. Let's see if the test results corroborate our theory. This is big. So she straight up went back. Dude. I can't believe she went back. Fireflies. If you guys haven't seen uh, Troy Baker, the uh, the live reenactment of, uh, or well, when he was acting the mocap portion of this sequence, you should do yourself a favor. If you if you played the game, you should go and check it out. Look up Troy's performance. There's also a really fun one where they they uh, 
start doing like some musical theater randomly in the middle of like a really intense scene and uh it's just delightful um but yeah so um oh thanks Raito yeah I'm like this is what happens when I'm when I'm kind of playing absentmindedly or like thinking about other stuff well thank you for that I miss I miss stuff and now you know why I'm like constantly Don, you know, I'm glad I cataloged and collected all this rare hospital equipment, and as soon as I'm done, I hear that there's no use for it anymore. I cannot fucking believe you guys voted to disband. I get it, this was a miracle that slipped through our fingers. It's fucking shitty, but the whole world is shitty. How can we give up like this? What now? Seattle and QZs? Join some third-rate resistance groups? Fuck that. Someone still has to care. I'll spend the rest of my life trying to find them, or die trying. Wow. So they never gave up. Yeah, um, here, while this spooky music is playing, I'm going to quickly see if I can find it. Oh, they did one with an, with an orchestra. Hang on. It was a joke ending. Okay. When, whenever you want to check this out, y'all. It's just, I didn't, I don't know if this... I haven't seen the orchestrated version, but uh, I've been to a few cons with Troy, and uh, I haven't got to like chat with him too much. But I did give him like, I was like, dude, really enjoyed you in Bioshock and fucking incredible work in Last of Us. You you should check it out. It's just lovely. Um, anyway. Oh, you out, Joyabi? Peace. Tech, thank you for the kitties, nya. <laughs> thank you. That goes to their their kitten food fund. Thanks, Tech. Appreciate appreciate, so appreciate those bits. Training rookie noobs. And thanks for that follow charge bolt two o Juan. Was this the room? This was the room, dude. This was the room where it all went down. I didn't realize Ellie went back. She knew the whole flipping time, dude. Oh, I even thought about that. I was like, what if she knew the whole time? She kind of treated Joel like it a little bit. Paul's like, did you, did you find any important things that would incriminate what, what I said to you in the first game? This is this is the face of oh no I got a screenshot with the screenshot on there, it's dumb. There we go. That's the face of uh, I'm about to tell you a lie. Yeah, there's there's kitty cats, 
currently trying to escape and if explore. One more time, I'll put a bullet through you. I'm gone. You will never see me again. But if you tell me the truth, I'll go back to Jackson. No matter what it is. Oh, man. Come on, bro. You gotta do it. Set you free. Stop hiding. Come on. No, dude. Don't give up. Say it. Come on. Yes. Yes. Yep. Becky, your life's meaning. Would have killed you. Yes. Thank you. Fuck. I'm so happy. I don't think I can post that one because it says, so I stopped them. Oh. oh my Heart, dude. Don't you fucking touch me. I'll go back. But we're done. That's like what it must be like to be and I'm I mean I only have nephews right but this is like I imagine what it's like to be a parent trying to explain like but by the way this is of course like who could ever be in this situation right but Joel went for it. Joel went for it, man. But thank I'm so grateful. I'm so, so gr the I'm so grateful he gave it a shot. Thanks for the follow. Uh Nurks, New York RX Cerro. Um super grateful that he did. Because even though it's you know, it's the harder road. Living in lies, he's like I He's like, I could either lose you forever, because you clearly found something in there. I either lose you forever, or uh, you hate me for the rest of your life, and at least I get to be kind of close to you. Oof. Damn. Damn, that changes, like, everything at the beginning of the game, you realize, when he comes and plays that Pearl Jam song and everything. I guess those med, med packs aren't really as effective as we all think. Just jacked up. Yeah, I thought so too, Jopsa. At least, you know, an opportunity for, for growth, an opportunity for something else. But he made that call, dude. You reap what you sow. You can't live behind that, those half-truths and omissions forever. Oh, now this is, this is really uh, homey for me. I went to theater school and I love seeing backstage stuff like this. Look at the shoes neatly organized. Some wingtips. This is the female dressing room. Uh, 
I thought it was maybe tap shoes. Oh man. You know? Jesse? Yeah, no med pack can stand up to plot injury. Did, did did she just casually take out her silenced pistol like that? The war, the merrier. Hey, look, Joel. It's your favorite. But also, because of Joel, she's here. You know what I mean? She was willing to sacrifice everything as a kid, which, by the way, is like noble as hell but also you are a kid and look at all these things to hide behind and stuff oh man am i gonna like walk in on them doing it that that would kind of bum me out a little bit. Yeah, right. So I'm like, this is definitely this looks like um, Uncharted with all the all the stuff, the ancient fangs. All right. Well, anyway. Dina? Jesse? Who are those two? You've learned many impressive things since you joined that squad. Oh, thanks, Hannah. Um, I, I wanted to do this because I wasn't sure if there... I don't know if there's any like secret, but I'll say this. Uh, I'm not. I'm not looking for a secret or anything. But what is that song called? Um, future days. Surely lose myself Everything I have found dear I've not found by myself Try sometimes And you'll succeed To make this man of me all my stolen missing parts I no need for any more it's C over B I don't think we have it I believe and I believe I can see our few as a minor should day, days <laughs> days of you and me that's not exactly how it goes but what if Ellie was like what if she was like let's see well, a 
Joel. Oh, Joel. Well, uh, you done done me in your bed. I felt it. Tried to be chill, but you're so hot that I melted. I fell right through the cracks. Now I'm trying to get back. Before the cool done run out, I'll be giving it my bestest. And nothing's going to stop me but divine intervention. I reckon it's again my turn. To win some or learn some, but I won't hesitate no more, no more. This is our fate. I'm yours. I gotta kill that clicker. Oh, but I'm, I'm all out of bottles and bricks. I'm all out of bottles and bricks. Oh, oh, Joe. I wish I stealthed a little harder. I would have a lot more ammo. I could just, wouldn't have to beg, steal, or barter. But now I'm chasing Abby halfway across the country. Oh, if you just didn't save me Back when the fireflies had me Well, everything would be easier, don't you think? At least I think so Why did you not just let me go? Oh, I won't hesitate no more, no more. This is my fate. I'm yours. I wish I had more Molotovs. <laughs> um, you know, I want to know what happens next in the game, but uh, since we, I've been letting this go for like four hours and I said I was going to go cook, I feel like now's a good time to go cook. I do want to show you one of the cats, though. So you're the newbie in training so, with um, Yeah, I think, uh, oh, thanks, Mir P448. Um, let me, um, man, Ellie, feel for you, girl. You've learned many impressive things since you joined that squad. I always feel like I, I say that to my friends and family all the time, like, man, I'd be like a spirit of vengeance if something bad happened. Um, oh, thanks for the follow, Bub Dad. Um, and the host, Callie Cat McGee. But um, I'd like to show you one of the cats, if that's possible. Um, I don't know how they feel about being picked up, but I'm gonna give it a shot. So, uh, just a moment. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this, and I'm gonna do. That's a lot of rain, isn't it? Sorry about that. All right, let me see if I can find a find that Kit Kat and show you guys. One sec. Hey, sweetie, is it okay if I I borrow uh, Bella?
her. Now you just had your food, so you're all nice and full. But. Look at this fool. She's like, what is happening? What is happening? Ah, it's too new. It's too new. Ah, come on, Bella. Here you go. All right, sorry, she's a little rambunctious, y'all. Sorry, that was so short-lived, y'all. Um, <laughs> she's like, she's full on like in heat and is like trying to squirrel everywhere. The kittens are already crawling all over the, we have like this towel rack and they're like, they ain't wasting no time, y'all. So at least you get to see Bella. Um, uh, so <laughs> we still have to get them fixed. She's got a little patch of fur missing. We gotta like, I think it might might be, hopefully it's not like ringworm or anything, but we don't. <sighs> These are like cats that were on like a, a place with like a bunch of other animals. And so we're, we're trying to, you're trying to help the the person who's taking care of them by like, you know, taking, taking a, a few of them away. So uh, anyway, uh, thank you for hanging out. It's been a lovely stream and uh, yeah, and we'll play again tomorrow night. I, I know, I'm certain, I have so much more to go on this game, but I'm gonna keep pushing and I wanna finish it. And then we can maybe test out a little bit, a little bit of um, Origami King, perhaps? Uh, some Paper Mario, even though I haven't played the first one. Um, but yes, that kitty cat is super small. She's so small. Um, yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Um, Paladins on Sunday, perhaps. I have, uh, I booked a film shoot. So uh, we have, my, my schedule starting to, to fill up awkwardly, which by the way, I may have to, I'll send a, I sent an email out to my, my, my sub friends out there, but for the other folks that aren't subbed yet, uh, uh, I, I'm an actor, <laughs> just so you know, for the folks that don't know. Um, and so I'm looking at my schedule right now and uh, I have a bunch of, Auditions at odd times. Some of them are at night, and like I'm shooting Tuesday. Uh, I should just, without even going into detail, my schedule is just getting a little more complex. So um, I'm still planning on streaming at night. It might be later than usual, um, but we're still on for Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday for sure. Sunday, uh, I have a read through for the movie that I'm shooting, um, even though I think I only have like a couple lines. <laughs> So, uh, but it'll be nice to know the story because that's what's important. You got to know the story you're telling. So anyway, and I have another thing I have to film, but that would be cool. Let me know what time you want to do it, Hannah. Uh, also, if you guys have Left 4 Dead, we could try that or that Code Vein game, which I've never even played. So if you play Code Vein, if you don't mind, if you want to play with me, you can uh, maybe shoot me a DM on the old, on the old Twitter or on Twitch or something um, and let me know. But uh, yeah. So I'm going to hit it. I'm going to go hang out with these Kit Kats and I will see you guys tomorrow night. Thanks for chilling. Yeah.